Hi guys. So today we're going to be learning how to do a headstand for beginners. Okay. As we go through this, I want you to remember that I am not a professional. Okay. I am not a professional and I'm learning this process as I go through it with you guys. So I'm going to show you what I did uh, to make it easy for me to do a headstand. And hopefully it works for you as well. And remember to do not rush this process. Do not rush this because we don't want anybody to get hurt. So first off, we're going to start out with our body in child pose. Okay? Just relax your body. Loosen up a little. Make sure your body is not tense. Make sure all those muscles are ready to be used. Okay? Once you're going to come up out of child's pose and you're going to Put your hands here like this but first off we want you to remember when you put your head down on the mat you do not put your forehead on the mat a lot of people mess up doing that I I am one I messed up when I first started and I was using my forehead instead of the very top of my head so you want to make sure you use the top part of your head if not you're gonna put a strain on your neck and your uh, shoulder like your back right here it hurts very bad, okay? So make sure to use the top of your head, which is here, and not here. And remember to make sure your core is, is strong as well because you're gonna have to use a lot of your core in this and your arms. So make sure like your biceps and everything is like kind of on point because you're gonna need all of that. Okay, so we're gonna put our hands here, right outside of our knees and a little bit above our knees. You want your knees right in the middle of your hands, and you're gonna take your forehead, your hands, not your forehead, I'm sorry. You're gonna take your head and make sure it's down like that. Then you're gonna come up and downward dog, and then you're gonna walk. Walk your body, okay? Don't be afraid if your feet come above the ground. You want your feet to come above the ground. You don't want to put too much on your head. You know everything is in a quarter, so you're gonna come up like but I'm going to show you the easy way is to put your knee, put one knee up on the other one, and then bring the other knee up on the other one. Just rest there for a while. Rest, five, breathe, okay? Three, four, five. Then you're going to come down, back into child's pose. Take a deep breath, relax, huh? just move around a little. Whatever tension that was there, we're gonna just kind of release it. And, and now that you have taken your breath, we're gonna come back up and we're gonna come back into that same position. Okay, remember, do not rush the steps. If you have to stay there on your elbows for a while, stay there until you get it. It may take a couple of days, it may take a couple of weeks or months, however, you know, it's up to you. So do not rush the process. So we're gonna come back up again. Hands outward, knees in the middle of hands, and head down, and we're gonna do the downward dog. Make sure your toes are on the way in. Walk up on your toes. Prop one elbow up. I meant one knee on one elbow, and then bring the other one up. Once you're comfortable, you can come up like this, like eggshell. You can do that. And make sure you take your time. Make sure you take your breath. Like breathe in. And then once you're comfortable with that, we're going to come back down again. And we're going to relax. We're going to relax into child's pose again. And some of you, if you want, don't want to do child's pose, Position, head down, 
And let's do that downward dog. And we're going to bend those toes and walk it in. And we're going to get back up on our knees. And we're going to go up a little higher this time. your body so just take as many breaths as you as you need or as many breaks as you need and if you have to stick with one step for a while don't be afraid to stick with that step do not rush the process because we do not want you to hurt yourself we want you to enjoy it and have fun and love yourself as you do this you know don't rush the process okay and we're gonna take our legs up all the way up in the air this time okay Let's hope I don't fall. Don't be afraid of falling as well, because I fall a lot. All right. We're gonna do all the steps over. And we're gonna take one leg up, then the other leg up. Make sure toes are in. And when you come back down, you're gonna come back down the same way you went up. One leg down, other one, prop up. Then come all the way down, and you're gonna go back into your child's pose and just shake it off, guys. Shake it off. Just relax. Yes. Enjoy it. Have fun with it. Don't rush it. Just. <laughs> it feels so good, you guys. But anyway, that's all I have for beginners headstand. Hopefully, you can learn from this. And as I learn more, I will share that with you. So please enjoy this and tell me how you feel about it. If, if you practice on it, let me know if it works for you or not. Leave your comments below, like this, share this, and if you're not subscribed already, please subscribe. Bye, guys.